During this, they rock back on their tails to impress potential mates. Occasionally, fights break out. With creatures this size, the forces at work during these confrontations are colossal, enough to shatter ribs and shake the ground. The victor wins the right to mate. Our female is approached by a young male. She responds to his calls first by stamping and then generating very low frequency mating calls. This so-called infrasound is too low for most animals to hear. However, he picks these signals up through the ground and responds by walking close to her, rubbing his body down hers. She shows she is receptive. Mating is a dangerous activity for the female. She is going to have to carry at least an extra 10 tons on her back. As she has grown older, the vertebrae over her hips have become fused and reinforced to help her cope with this ordeal. After a few days, the Diplodocus have calmed. The female feeds on the edge of the herd, but she is still not large enough to be immune from attack, and she is unaware she is being watched. An Allosaurus knows she is vulnerable. The predators wait for her to become distanced from the herd. <laughs> 